Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Hello X4. There. So today we are going into Xenon Space. We're going back to Xenon Space, I guess, more than anything. Uh, we've been there before, and uh, we're working on that mission, finding the Yaki Home Sector, basically. So uh, we might as well work on that, shall we? Are you guys actually nearby? I think it's like over here, yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to go that way. There we go. We're going to go this way instead. Okay, so, uh, yeah, on the way to uh, Yaki Space, basically, or Xenon Space, the, I'm, I'm guessing it's going to end up taking us to their pirate base here. There was this one here, Yaki, or the Yak Pirate Base, actually. Um, but I'm guessing that's kind of what it's about. Well, we'll find out anyways. Cerberus, Vanguard. So that is the arcane function of that peculiar apparatus. Those Xenon do not recognize you as an enemy. Oh, yeah, it's Danger. convert. I forgot Entering that about that little device. Yeah, it's, it's changing our identity, I guess, or whatever. Where are we going here? Oh, we're going all the way over here. Okay. Superhighway, Arcus Cascade, 17. Oh, look at them. P. They're just negative 10 now. Huh. Super Highway, Arcus. Cascade, That's cool. Seventeen. Also weird. <laughs> it's like, Cover oh, we're, we're trying to be friends with the Xenon. It's not really about that. It's just for the fact that, um, you know, it's for the mission and stuff like that. And it's, I guess, the idea is it's just like kind of camouflages you. I guess to them they think you're just one of them, so Cover they just ignore you. Yaki. What I might do is put some solar panels down here. My turret's on to defend. I'm pretty sure there's a button that switches that, but uh, danger hazardous the region current target detected. should work. Yeah, I'm gonna put some. Uh, might as well put some of these uh, down when I get closer to them. That way we can have them. Now they'll they'll, they'll probably destroy some of these, but the good news is uh, advanced satellites are a little further away, and you know it won't be bum right into their gate and things like that. So it'll last a little bit longer, basically. And oh, I thought we just derped up on that one. Cover deactivated. Entering Arcus Cascade 17. This one's probably too far now. Oh well. Jump gate. Yeah, I kind of dropped up on that one. Number seven. It, the nine, interface doesn't eight. automatically. Oh, it might slow down enough. Oh yeah, it looks like it slowed down enough. The interface doesn't uh, kind of stop fast enough. So, oh my goodness, is that a? Yeah, that's one of them. P. So th there's K. the, the K's, Cover right? Those activated. are the big uh, yeah, xenon P. chips we've seen. That, you know, the other NPCs and stuff have been able to handle, okay? I. Well, this thing here is called an eye. And it's a little bit more scary because it's much, much bigger. Much, 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 much more tougher. Basically, it's death. Pretty cool, though. Jump gate. Matrix. Number. Seven. Nine. Honestly, B. you get one of those into a sector... It honestly could probably annihilate the entire sector without too much hesitation. Like that's they're they're, they're kind of ridiculously powerful. I've had them before in uh, my other uh, update three gameplay there with the split vendetta, and uh, honestly, it was like to the point where they they were just clearing sector from sector to sector. It was just it was ridiculous. You should find the teleporter now has a much larger range. Oh, that's cool. I guess we got that up. We'll have to work on that research soon too. Okay, deploy advanced satellite. And then we might as well get one here in a minute. Entering system matrix number seven nine. Let's go upwards B. so we don't bump into anything accidentally. Break out. Jump gate. Savage spur. So, like I said, they, they'll probably destroy these over time Cover anyways, but um, it is nice to have the, them to keep an eye on them, their movements. If anyone's... It's not even about their movements as much as it's keeping an eye on, say, like, there's uh, somebody decides to go in and flood in there and attack them, things like that. Then, you know, they, they might start building outposts and bases and stuff like that, and you can partake in that. And you get a lot a bit more uh, uh, credits, too, for those type of missions that they'll offer, so... Cover activated. Yaki. That was an actual Yaki Yaki one. Okay. 
recover deactivated. <laughs> There you go. Entering so like that. system. Savage spur. So what's happening here? Oh, How defeat. I'm detecting multiple entities with outspokenly murderous intent. Evidently, masking a ship's identity does not accomplish much if the ship is clearly of Terran design. <laughs> so Junkie. I guess because we didn't keep the other ship, Number it's really seven, uh, nine B M. Yeah. They don't like us. Stay around the gate in case we need to flood back through it. Okay, so what do we P. have here? A P? Let's go for the P first. They can do a lot of damage. I can't jump. There we go. We got it. I need to get in travel mode. I didn't realize it can kick my ass that well. It's not like we have M. Yeah, it's just an M. M. And another M. 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 We're we're good. It's just I need to cool off a bit here. I don't want my hull going down. That's all. M. There you go. how I feel. <laughs> I'm not sure how I like this, but okay. We'll try it out. That's awesome. Uh. What is this? A Xenon station? I think we might have already passed one of these earlier. I must say, I am rightly flabbergasted by his intricate entanglement. And such an aggressive color scheme. Oh, no sightseeing. <laughs> no sightseeing. Uh. Yeah. Oh, this is pretty cool looking. Okay. I don't know if I like the idea of docking here, but we'll go for it. Let's get a pyre here so we can get in. Oh, actually, this doesn't have a roof. Okay, never mind. Docking granted. Well, it has a roof. That's the problem. I thought it was more open. Pirate base. There we go. If they don't try to steal my ship or something. Hello. Hello. Oh, glad you're reasonable, stranger. I'm adding you to the admission list for my office. <laughs> Thank that you. That does sound eerily familiar. I think I will terminate my communications for now and observe quietly. <laughs> okay. Finally, come in. Well, where do I start? 
Where would you start if you were in my place? We have suddenly barged into our system in a Terran made warship. You're a damn security risk! Ah, uh, then why am I still alive? Because you're not the first to arrive here. Ever since the realignment of the gates, we're picking up scrappers, adventurers, scientists. Maniacs! All of you! <laughs> but we can't let anyone die out here. There are already far too few of us. Uh, then why am I... Okay, are you trying to recruit me? I'm not asking you to join the Yaki. We all have our allegiances. But I am asking you to have a closer look. Make your rounds, see how we live. Might just change your perspective. Uh, what is this place? Oh, have I not made my formal speech yet? <laughs> Welcome to the home of the Yaki. Freedom loving, freebooting, and uh, who am I kidding? What you see here is the last remnant of the Yaki, at least the last that we know of. When those gates shut down two generations ago, my people got stranded here together with the Xenon. Most died in that first week. A few found hiding spots inside an abandoned outpost. And then, some stars and augmentation artists found the solution. Uh, how did they survive? These things on my face, they're not just for show, you know? I don't exactly know how they function, but they keep the scene on the way, most of the time. But that's not all. This op art also lets a few of the most Gifted Yaki do things to the Xenon, brought them here and there. It doesn't always work, and you've seen what happens when you indulge too much, but it kept us alive. And so here we are, pirates to some, abominations to others, and with the Xenon strapped to our back like a damn tumor. <laughs> doesn't matter if we stay or leave. Either way, we're fair game. Okay, um, so Obelisk was killed in that fight. Oh, yeah, I gotta talk about that, yeah. Good, then he's no longer a threat. Don't get me wrong, it's kind of sad that he's gone. He was a good Yaki once. But the way he plastered himself with those cybernetics, with no regard for his or our safety? There's really only one way this could have ended. Uh, Tamitha died because of me. That's a real shame. Oh. I can only hope you regret it. Actually, I kind of did. Tamitha left because she saw the end approaching from light years away. But she still tried to help us out from a distance. Uh, seems like it caught up with her first. Uh, are you letting me leave? Damn right I am. Thanks to that fool obelisk, the war is already underway. With you on the loose, there'll at least be one more pilot with a brain. <laughs> and a conscience, I hope. Let's kill Another the thing, I called you a stranger earlier, and that was a lie. <gasps> My friend? There's someone I'd like you to meet. Oh, never mind. Hey. Well, this is kind of awkward. <laughs> Don't know if you were expecting to see me. Maybe you were. Maybe that's why you came in the first place. This is my wingman, by the way. What counts is that you're here right now. Uh, why did you disappear? That's not an easy question to answer. I guess I was kind of overwhelmed back there. If you remember, we thought we were hot on a trail, and then everything went nova. 
Uh, Organic pulled me out when that maniac obelisk disabled my ship. Um, uh, been here since then. Flying with the Aki. Um, testing out my powers. Meet me outside. We'll talk some more when we're back in our pilot seats. Okay. It was nice meeting you, ma'am. Hello. Oh my gosh, you can hire these guys? Uh. Goodbye. I, I, I want a female Yaki then. Sorry. Their voice is so cool. That's, you know. So let's check just random places here. See if we can get ourselves a female Yaki here. Yeah, not too much for me. Wait, they have regular voices? Hello. Goodbye. Oh, they just have regular voices, I just realized. Maybe the females are different, though? I don't know. Did we... Was that where we already were in? I probably. Yeah, it was. Representative office, yeah, okay. So I think you can be allied with these, probably buy blueprints and stuff, too, then, because of that. Oh, here we go. Greetings. <laughs> Holy shit, look at her. Uh, yeah, look at this. Show me your licenses. Uh, no, no licenses. Goodbye. Show Greetings. me your blueprints. So you can buy blueprints here. Interesting. None right now. Oh, no, there it is. You can buy this one. And you can buy an S ship. We can't do it yet, though. No rep, I guess, for it. Yeah. Oh, uh, damn. Oh, and you can do the regular. Yeah, a lot of them you can just buy, like, other faction Goodbye. ones. I think if they're mixed factions. But, uh... That is so cool. Um, okay, so let's go... Actually, I'm not done yet. Let's go to... Actually, where are we supposed to go, by the way? Oh, on dock, sorry. Will you be a Yaki too, Hello then? there. I guess, yeah. <laughs> I don't know, that just seems cool. Let's actually check their Can trade. I help? I'm just interested. Show Here me your you wares. Go. We're gonna feel around. Well, this is just mostly what's on me, not them, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's just kind of interesting. Pretty cool, though, if you ask me. So there you go, anyways. If you want some Yaki on board your ships here, you can get them from here over time. So let's go back to our ship. That's actually weird, isn't it? Uh, go to ship. Cover activated. Yaki Katana. Can I help? Oh, sir. Sorry. Okay, let's do a save here. Okay, so we're gonna undock here. All right, time for street talk. First of all, it's damn good to have you back. I've been waiting for an opportunity, and here it is. Secondly, this place stinks. We're about to take a real close look at the heap at its center. And thirdly, it's really good to have you back. <laughs> Just wanted to make that clear <laughs> anyway we should get going if you have something on your mind just call me yeah what are we doing near this thing then wow this is really cool amphitheater okay we're here time to clue you in about the real deal that over there, my friend, is an amplifier station. Amplifier. The only one under Yaki control. You've seen what heavily augmented Yaki can do with their cybernetics, eh? This thing, if turned on, further increases the strength and range of those Xenon attacks. Organic says they need it for their own safety. And as a dead man switch when the Protectorate inevitably finds and attacks this place. But she doesn't understand. No, none of them understand. All they're doing is hiding and delaying until they suffocate, or someone like Obelisk snaps and turns this side of the gate network into a slaughterhouse. In the end, despite all their precautions and with all the technology in the universe, these people have nowhere to go except out and through. This system, this entire situation is a giant ticking time bomb. There's only one way to stop it once and for all. We have to destroy that amplifier. It's brutal, but Mission Command has trained us to make hard choices. These people have shown me kindness. 
but I'd trade them all in for the safety of Saul. I have to admit, yeah, I think we do need to destroy it. Uh-oh. I've gathered a handful of fighters who want to stop this downward spiral at once, regardless of their own fate. It's gonna take serious preparation to make this work, but you've always kept a cool head when I couldn't. Awaiting your command, wing leader. Okay. Oh. Hello there, pilot. Since you and your friend have already inspected the merchandise, I guess there's nothing else for it. It's time to put all our cards on the table. When you've got a moment, have a look at the briefing I just sent you. Uh, and before you flip your hat, I'm not asking you to betray Earth. Well, I guess I am, but, you know, desperate times and all that. Think about where you want your loyalties to lie. Mull it over, consider all possible consequences. You're not the first to attempt this mission, but you might just have a shot at success. Your current mission contains multiple parallels, and you can track them the status of each mission of the manager on the top of the map. Okay. So we'll see what this map thing says. Oh, it's saying more now. Oh. Is she insane? She can't possibly think that we would ever ally ourselves with her against the Protectorate. Oh, yeah, no. Oh, uh, actually, now that I think about it. <coughs> God, these pieces of human trash are already contemplating genocide to save themselves. There's no reason we shouldn't do the same. Yeah, you know what? Let's tell Mission Command about this whole mess. Get the Terran Navy to warm up the big guns. Please, my ethically challenged assistants. <laughs> Consider the immeasurable suffering this may bring upon these poor people. Oh, shut up, Squid. Nobody invited you. <laughs> okay, so is it my turn to see? Or are you guys going to say something else here? Do I get to make any choices here? Um, okay, so let's check out our missions here. Um, oh, map. Missions manager. There you go. So, save them from themselves. Uh, mutually insured instruct destruction. Uh, and smoking gun. Talk to... Yeah, no, they'll, they'll invade them. These guys want to kill Earth. And this one seems to save them from their cells, which that's actually probably not a bad idea. It means that they're going to, you know, we destroy this and then everyone hopefully will win. This is going to suck once we shoot this, isn't it? Okay, my friends, we're going to do another save here. We might have to reload because, like, we'll have to learn tactics and stuff. Big part of the game, anyways. Okay, my friends, I don't know how well this will work. I don't know who's going to even try to kick my ass. I don't know how any of this is going to work. Where's that Yaki station, anyways? It's over here if we need to run to it. Cover deactivated. Amplifier station. There you go. Looks like we're all firing. Oh, this might be easy then. I don't really have the weapons for this, unfortunately, but... Can I do this and just go... Oh no, it, it aborts the second I do it. And now you have to wait for your weapons to cool down. Will other ships attack us, I wonder, or are we fine? The Yaki don't like this one bit. Here they come. Uh oh. Doesn't sound good when they're coming after us. Oh yeah. oh my goodness. They're coming for me, aren't they? Holy crap, they're coming everywhere. If they're coming for me, I'm doomed. Let's see who they're coming for then. Your 
in serious trouble. Yeah, they're coming for me, it looks like. Let's see here. They they stopped chasing me. It's like I'm not taking my chances and getting my ass whooped, to be honest. But yeah, they're not. They're slow boating it if they are. Let's see over here. Go away. Asteroid. I don't really want to fight Allow the Yaki, but in. I guess you have to. I don't know how well this will end up for us, but here we go, my friends. Holy crap. Holy crap. They did a lot of damage in that the first attack, I guess. They do a lot of damage. Have you actually flown a real ship before? <laughs> Corral Kami. You're really asking for it now. Those are some big ships too. They got a lot of firepower on their side though. Damn. You call yourself a pilot? I think we're just gonna have to drag them over here. Yeah, I think that's maybe the best way to do this. Just drag them. So if we have them targeted, if we go shift and then... There you go. Match your speed, let them follow me. Crap, I think they stopped. Oh no, they're still following, sorry. So they're following at 500, so we have to wait a while. Can I speed this up? Let's see. Ah. You're in serious trouble. There you go. I'll see Sita for this one because this have is too painful. Flown a real ship before? There you go. Oh crap, they gave up. I think they gave up and returning. Damn it. I guess once you get out of a certain range, they go back to the thing here. Damn it, did they just go all the way back there? Amplifier or am I clicking the wrong target? I might have clicked the wrong target, but whatever. You're in serious trouble. Um. Whatever, we'll go in and start taking out these smaller ones, see if we can do. I guess we're gonna just have to play a bit of run back and forth and kind of dodge these guys a bit, potentially. That's fine. We'll do that. There we go. We're starting to get some good hits off them on me. We're going to have to get out of here again. M. I've got you now. Started to go on the side, which sucks. There you go. Like, I need you to go right where I can hit you easiest, buddy. There you go. Come on, we gotta get him here. You're going to there you go. We're doing pretty good now. Um. These machines are getting better. Go away. 
bad. Who's shooting me now? This guy here? Is not on anyone yet. I guess we'll have to go to him. But I want my loot. There you go. There you go. Time to wipe you out. Corral Kami. Is our target? Oh, over here. Oh, Holy crap! I didn't realize we're doing this bad. And this is where we're gonna fail. You're in serious trouble. Yeah, there's no way we're gonna navigate out of this. I have no shield, so I can't get anywhere. Oh, critical. Yeah, they have too many turrets on them. And we lost it. Yeah, there's so many of them now. I didn't even see my shields go down that fast. And then once that goes, they're gonna go after me. Boom! And then there we go, we gotta load. So, we'll be back. Okay, so I'm playing the smart way here and slowly dragging these guys here. Once in a while, I'll go back and do a small attack, though they're taking out our little wingman, unfortunately. But uh, uh, it seemed like a better idea to go back and antagonize them a bit, just prevent them from uh, from going away on us anyway. So it seems to be working so far. Get out of here. So I'll go backwards once in a while, just make sure, you know, we're getting some shots and in and... They're not, uh, they're not N. thinking they can escape us. That, that looks like one of the other M. groups. N. There you go. It's that guy there who will put a whole new hole on the oh, earth on me. The ones with the, the medium ones, they're, they're badass. They can do so much damage to me. <laughs> But anyways, that's what I do. I kind of keep uh, ahead of them, and I'm slowly dragging them here. So there's three gr three. There were three groups here. They're all kind of all bunched up right now. But it wasn't just one. It was three of them. So. And they go about three ten or something like that. So. As long as you kind of drag them along, you should be good. This one's safe. I, I, even though they're pink, I guess because of the yak. Yeah, although they're in Xenon and then yak ships, yeah. It's because we have the faction colors on. You can turn that off, obviously, so. Is that the best you've got? There you go. That looks a bit better. <laughs> Get oh, that one's really getting... Uh, they boosted there. That's because they got into combat, so. M. A lot more soon. I'll wipe you out. I don't like that one, but hopefully we'll be fine. And you'll have to do more damage than that. M. Let's get up in here. They've kind of fallen behind over time, so. Face. You're making a big mistake. We should be good. They're almost here, so I just don't like the pissed off like they screwed this up over here, so these guys kinda ran back. We might even you. lose them, unfortunately, but I don't even know who they're fighting at this point. Like legit Xenon are fighting them then maybe? I don't know. Not good enough. Okay. So are you guys shooting me? I got distracted yeah. there. there go. Oh, there they are. Anyways, we're here, so we should be pretty safe now. And 
I'm hoping this base will defend them. We can always run in here too. Hide. Docking granted. There you go. Oh yeah, I hear their uh, station defense is going off. I think if you dock, you'll they'll lose target of you too. I think. So it might be not a bad idea to dock and then come out again, kind of thing. Successfully docked. Welcome. Thank you and goodbye. Um. Anyways, they're gonna get their asses handed to them now. M. M. Now here's a trick. Will I get any kills in now that this is going on? M. There you go. Here's one over here. An M. Pretty much a little World of War kind of thing going on here. Pretty cool. N. You'll have to do better than that. N. Oh crap. I can't even see it. What the hell? There you go. Half of my shields in one shot. Those basically can destroy my ships pretty fast. Okay. Docking granted. So, yeah, it's going pretty good here. So that's not mine though, right? No. So I'm wondering if a regular Xenon group joined Welcome. in and is taking those guys out, but... So far, so good, you know? Looks like they got one of the bigger ones here, and then there's that, that one there that's slowly going down. Now there might be one that returned unfortunately, unless he's out here, but I don't see him anywhere, so I don't see a corpse. Oh no, there it is. That would be one. Crap, I think they're returning. Oh, I can't even fight one group with that. And they're 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 going back, damn it. Oh, I just screwed up with my ship driving here. So yeah, it looks like I'm doomed on that part. So this is gonna take a while. This is gonna be a lot of. I don't have the firepower, obviously. No one said I needed to bring a fleet of ships, and a little harder to do it with just one ship like this. But it's all right. So basically, we have to go back towards our guidance here. Yeah, they look they like they've left, unfortunately. Amplifier station. And that took a while, by the way, to drag them that far, so. That wasn't just a one, two, three, that was a hell of a long drag for them just to run all the way back. So they're not anywhere. Oh, yeah, there they are. The only thing I can think of is just go in and shoot the big one, but. These four saves take so long. N, 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 Corral Kami. There you go. If you could get that one without getting hit, you'd be a winner. There you go. Just don't get hit by it. You're dead. You're not taking me out like that. You're making a big mistake. There you go. Maybe we can just stay on their tail and then we haven't wouldn't have issues if they can't get a direct hit on us. They are all the firepower, so if I take them out, then we're, we, we, we survive. This is starting to get worried. There we go. N. Okay, let's get out of here. Because then we can boost out of here, and then, there we go, to jump. Like I said, they are all the firepower, so if he's gone then that should let us survive, so. M. Um. 
We can just chill here. Take these guys out. Container. Well, the good news is we're, we're doing pretty good now, I'd say. <laughs> oh. And we're trying to recharge our shields here, not lose our shields, buddy. There you go. Container. Okay. Ooh, look at eight of them on that one. Okay. Amplifier station N. So are these just the original ones? There were so many of them to begin with, or are these just like more um, that showed up? It's hard to tell because they're all xenon tagged, right? So. Sorry, I didn't mean to hit you. It's all right. N. Just don't do it again. N. There's another one coming. I think we're doing something good here now. Okay, let's let that loot go. Let's see. T. behind me, I guess. Oh, T. Those guys maneuver a lot faster, so. Crap. I thought we got all the other, but there's one more. We're gonna avoid that one until we have full shields here. We'll give me a minute. Oh, okay. Oh, here we go. I guess this is it. You're that could be your last mistake. Oh, it boosted like crazy, which is not too bad because it uses up a lot of its shields. catch up so it doesn't regen too much here. Have you actually flown a real ship before? There you go. Now we have you. Winner. Oh, oh. There you go. Unfortunately, Yaki's going to hate, hate us with all the killing, but... There you go. Okay, we might have gotten them all now. So in the end, uh, it kind of didn't work out as well, but dispersing them around helped, obviously, so. Amplifier station. There we go, we're back to killing this. This will take a while, though, unfortunately. So we'll leave this a bit and come back. Oh, interesting. So it was like 70-something or 8? Oh. Oh, they blow up in... Anyways, it blew up in like one big module, so I'm not quite sure how that worked, but uh, it did that anyway, so it lost a huge percent of its health, so it might be scripted that way. So maybe you're not supposed to destroy all of it one by one, or maybe there was something else that caused it, I'm not sure. But, uh, anyways. Just slowly going down. Well, there it goes. Another module just blew up. Okay, so it seems like each of the modules break one by one, so... And then they destroy, like, a big chunk of it, so that's not too bad. I just have to take this last one out and we're good to go here. Let's 
So what I can do between cooldown is I can do this. Sita for the cooldown, and then there you go. <laughs> I don't use Sita much for myself, but like, to be honest, it's not bad for a let's play because then you can speed up certain parts of it, make it work better for the let's play so you guys aren't so boring. Or not you're boring, but you're not so bored. Yeah, the last part should be almost up here, I'm guessing, from what I saw with the other one. Probably like any second, to be fair. Just get that cooldown going here. So this should be our last uh, round, I'm guessing. Unless this one makes you do the full thing, but if it's destroying each of them like it was doing before, then this should be coming up any time. There you go. They seem very, very, very upset at us now. I think the best choice is for us to escape. Get out of the system now, or I can't assure your safety. <laughs> Well, it looks like they're taking somewhat the upper road. They could take our kick our ass in, but apparently they're going to let us go. So we'll get it out of the system, and I think we'll cut there, and then we'll continue next time and uh, go from there. You know, we're just trying to help them. We're not trying to screw them over, but... It's more like they were going over the top with that, right? Like, it could be used to destroy Terrans, or it could be used to make uh, Zelliot kind of, you know, whatever people, like the Obsidian guys. So it's like, eh, you know. That wasn't exactly unexpected. Let's see if we can get her to talk to us. Organic! Organic, are you there? We don't have to part like this! <laughs> I've got every single Yaki hotliner banging at my door, demanding my head because of you fools! Be glad that I held them back from hunting you down. Yeah, yeah, we're very sorry about that, but you didn't honestly expect a plan like that to work, did you? Listen, you've got to understand that this entire project was bound to fail. All it did was keep you holed up in your system, with no bright spot to light up your miserable existence. You put a gun to the gate network's head and expected no pushback? You have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Do you think that taking away the best protection we had against the Terran Scourge would somehow give us hope? How delusional can you be? You know your people best. No threat short of a total annihilation would keep them from scouring the entire gate network to subjugate or eradicate everyone who dares to oppose them. Thanks for your help. Here's a little something as thanks. Oh, I hate when they do that. Okay, so I guess now we go and have a chat with the other thing. Yeah, it looks like they're done. That stupid um. thing. There you go. Yeah, I guess now we, because we own this system, right? So, do we own it? It doesn't look like we own it. Maybe they don't have a thing in here yet. There's the Savage Spur. Here it is. Oh, no, they do own it. Okay. Okay, my friends, I think that is it then for this episode. The next time we'll go ahead and uh, we'll, we'll go talk to that and see what goes from there. And then we'll go on from there. So thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, all that fun stuff. And we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.